I'm using this video as a little tiny update. There's a couple things I wanna let you know about. First, there's next door, they, I guess they're like dog sitting or something. So if you hear barking over there, this uh, poor little yippy dog has been like barking all morning long, like for several hours. It's a little annoying, but I can just shut it out for whatever reason. Now, the second thing I'm gonna tell you about is a productivity tip. So I'll get to that in a second. And the third is around the live Q&A this week, which is not gonna be on Friday, but I'll tell you when it will be instead. And the fourth thing is sort of a call for your questions. So my wife and I are gonna start a podcast coming up pretty soon. We're actually gonna record, um, honestly re-record a couple episodes tonight. So that'll be the fourth thing. So number one, the dog is barking, not cool. Number two thing is around productivity. So one of the, <laughs> I got a lot done today. And one thing is I'm preparing to take a couple days off, actually like over a week off. And I'm kind of going to unplug, probably take the first vacation that I've really taken in like three years since I've gotten laid off. So I'm really looking forward to it. Also, I'm trying to get a lot of stuff prepared ahead of time so that I don't feel like, uh, I need to work while I'm trying to decompress and take some time off. So a lot of people are looking for productivity tips and everyone's a little bit different. I shift my like productivity methods and my to-do list or however I'm tracking things all the time. I, I'm testing new things all the time. And it turns out most of the time I get a ton of things done when I just focus up. So this morning when I went out on a walk, I just brought this little note card with me and a pen. This pen right here, a Pilot G2 pen and like just a scrap of paper. There are six things listed on there and that's it. That's all I'm gonna work on today. And I did the hardest, the, the most difficult, time-consuming thing first. And that's actually a video, it's gonna be in a playlist that I'm working with Alex from WP Eagle on that's coming out really soon. So keep an eye out for this basically a master class on the keyword golden ratio. Very, very cool stuff, we're going back and forth, and there's gonna be about 10 videos in this playlist. So I did that first, and the rest of the stuff is now going to be much easier. One thing I didn't do is list like everything that I need to do over the next four days because I would have been overwhelmed. It would have been like 15 things, and at the end of the day, I probably would not have gotten everything done. And then I'm like, oh, I didn't finish everything. I, I will go to bed stressed. Not a cool thing to do, so I'm just keeping it simple, and I'm keeping it straightforward in this more concise list. All right, moving on to the next point. I am taking the day off on Friday, but I still wanted to do a live Q&A. So I'm gonna do it tomorrow, which is Tuesday. It's gonna be in the afternoon for US Mountain Time. It'll be, I think I scheduled it for 3 p.m., but if you go to my channel, I'll put a link in here too, but if you go to my channel, you can actually go to the watch page, click the button to get a reminder, and you'll, you'll be notified. So if you wanna submit questions, feel free to uh, use the submission form, or you could even leave a comment here. I'll take a look at the comments as well. Here's the thing, I'm doing it in the afternoon, so maybe some other people will be able to watch. If you normally don't catch the live Q&A because it's in the middle of the day for you or the middle of the night, maybe you'll be able to watch it this time. So hopefully, you know, just changing up the times is a good thing. Let me know in the comments if you, if you like to have it at a different time every now and then. So that is the second thing. Now, or the third, I, I'm losing track. So part B, I, I'm, I have no idea which part I'm on now, is do you have questions for me that you would like for me to cover in like an intro of the podcast? So the podcast is generally going to be targeted towards like corporate professional people with nine to five jobs and or looking to like transition from a nine to five to like working for yourself. My wife does have a nine to five. She's had a corporate type job um, you know, throughout and I like had a corporate job until I got laid off. And then I started doing online marketing and doing affiliate marketing full time. And that was three years ago. We have different perspectives because of that, but we also have just generally different perspectives anyway on like <laughs> working. So we, yeah, we have opposing views, even though we have a similar background in consulting. The point is, 
people have questions about my background in general. So now's a, a great time. It'll be an intro episode and we may record a couple others tonight, but yeah, just let me know if you have any questions. Let, just type them in the comments. I'll take a look, but yeah, if you just have questions about my background or any of anything to do with like the transition of going from a corporate job to working for yourself, like surviving a corporate job, that sort of thing, just leave a comment or just like personal stuff. Like I know some people um, were interested in how we ended up in Montana from Atlanta, that sort of thing. So we'll, we'll see how it, uh, how it works out, but that's the, the general idea. And as I mentioned, we're going to re-record it. So the, we recorded two episodes like last week, just to sort of like test equipment and see how it would feel. And I don't think I prepared enough was, uh, you know, one of my flaws. And then the other part is we got too personal in some ways with like talking about uh, just details that were not important for people to know about. Not about us. It was more about our family and stuff. Basically, we we're talking bad about our family. So we had, we're like, all right, we got to re-record it. And that's all part of it. So anyway, we'll catch you tomorrow in the live stream. So don't forget to submit your questions if you want to. And I won't be around on Friday, but I'll still be you know publishing content while I'm out. Have a great day. We'll see you later.